Hi, today I'm going to show you how to replace a hard drive in a MacBook Pro. It's actually my sister's. Um, the hard drive is defective in it. It got sp something spilled on it. And uh, so I'm going to go inside and replace the hard drive. And it's actually the flash hard drive, and I'll show you all that when we get into it. All right, let's get started. Okay, there are two, two tools you'll need. Uh, for the screws on the bottom of the case, you'll need a Torx bit 1.2 millimeter and for the hard drive screw is a T5 um, 40 millimeter and that's also a Torx bit. So you're going to have uh, 10 screws on the bottom that you're going to remove and then once you pick this up, remove the bottom, excuse me, then you'll have the hard drive and I'll show you that. So let's get these screws off and then I'll show you where the hard drive is. Right here's the hard drive. You can have that one screw, the, the 1.5, I mean, excuse me, the T5 40 millimeter Torx bit. And once you remove that screw, this pops up and you can put the new one in. But let me back out and there's your whole, these are your batteries speaker and this is your motherboard here fans keep it cool anyway let's get that hard drive replaced okay now I've got the hard drive replaced I'm just gonna place the bottom back on and flip the laptop over and boot it up make sure I get the hard drive and see it make sure it's working uh, there's no software on it. I'm gonna have to install that I'm actually waiting for a copy of OS X 10 to uh, get here um, all right let me show you that okay there we go we're getting the Apple boot up And there's the setup. I did want to uh, add this on the laptop. When you're removing the 10 screws on the bottom, the two right here on the hinge are just uh, a whisker, almost like a thread depth shorter than the rest. So when you're going to put them back on, if you put the wrong one, it won't quite seat. Otherwise, all these should be flush. You shouldn't feel any of them raised above the hole. So if you put the wrong one in, it'll, it won't be flush. But when you put them together, I mean, when you... See if I can zoom in good enough. I should have showed you the difference of the two. This was an afterthought. You can see the, the longer ones have almost like a... And they extend, you know, they're not fully threaded because they have like almost like a little, I'm not showing very good, right there. You can almost see like where the thread stops before the head of the screw. The ones back here are, are fully threaded. I just wanted that in case anybody gets confused or, or leaves the wrong screw because now that it's going to, it's going to scratch if you drag it across the table, you know, and then eventually probably break off. Um, so just make sure all the screws are flush. The two on the hinge are the shorter. So there you have it. That was pretty easy. Uh, flash drives are pretty easy and actually laptops today, most of them are pretty easy with the SSD drives or even the two and a half drives. They usually sit in a little cradle and a few screws to take them out. All right. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, comment below and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button.